Hi, so on my nails today, I have this Essie, which is from their neon collection. I just have a little mini, and this is called, wait, is this upside down? Okay, this is called Neon Cochabella. If it will focus, eh, whatever, it's called Neon Cochabella, and it is a kind of purpley pink sort of shade. Um, I did do two coats on my nails. Honestly, it could have been opaque in just one, but I don't know. I thought that maybe it would deepen the color if I did a second coat. It didn't, so this was solidly one coater. It was a little bit on the thick side, and it was also a little bit sticky, so I can see how this might give me some problems in the future, but for right now, it's nice. So there's that. This also dries down, even though I wouldn't necessarily consider this a neon, but I don't know. It does dry down, so this one, if you do like a shiny finish, you would have to top coat this. Then over it, I used this um, Sinful Colors glitter. This is their Love Sprinkles glitter. I got this last Valentine's Day. I didn't wear it last Valentine's Day. I told myself I'd wear it this year, so I did. And it's just a clear base with a pale matte pink hex glitter in various sizes. And it also has white matte hex, no, white matte hearts, <laughs> heart glitters. Um, the glitters, ooh, it's like not, there we go. The um, hard glitters do sink to the bottom, if you could see that, so I did have to set this upside down for a while before I used it, and I was only actually able to get glitter on three of my nails, I actually got three on this thumb, but I was only able to get um, glitter on three of my nails. My right hand has, has no hearts at all because by the time I painted my right hand, all the glitter sunk to the bottom, so the glitter sinks pretty quickly, so I would definitely recommend like painting one hand, letting it sit upside down for a while, and then painting your other hand if you want glitter on both hands. Um, but I don't know, I think it's a really cute glitter, and I do like it. It was a little bit of a hassle to put on, but I don't particularly mind. Um, the hearts do, you know, pop off the nail, so what I would recommend is while it's still tacky, um, push down on the hearts so that they can sink into the polish and then top coat it and they feel pretty flush with my nail which is nice so I don't think that they'll be peeling up anytime soon um, but yeah I, I do really like this I think it looks really cute and yeah that's it for my nail today thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video bye